tonight we are here at the Sevier County Fair. You ready, Don? Let's do this. Here's the Sevier County Fairgrounds. This fair is August the 30th through September the 5th. So if you're going to be here Labor Day weekend, this is something you can come and, and do. We've been going to a lot of fairs. Yeah. <laughs> this year, haven't we? Oh yeah, we, we have got, been. We've been. We went to a, uh, a couple that we attended when we were younger, and today is our first our first time here at. Sevier County, the Sevier County Fair. Quite the backup, isn't it? <laughs> it looks quite busy, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. It does look busy. So there's multiple parking lots closer to the fair, but I guess we're out here in no man's land. <laughs> and I think it's gonna be quite the walk. So I would say get here earlier if you don't like to walk. Uh, we're okay with walking though. Mm -hmm. There's Mount Lacan at the end of the field over there. And we, we have parked, haven't we? Mm -hmm. And the sun's about to set. It looks like it'd be a beautiful evening. The sun's about to set and it's starting to get cooler. We're supposed to dip down into the 60s tonight. So it's gonna feel real good at the fair. And we have a little, just a little walk across this field. So that's the backside of Publix and Home Goods over there. Kind of give you reference on where we're at. Across over a little bridge here. Ah, I can smell the funnel cakes and corn dogs from here. They have a few different uh, food eating contests. I'm not going to do any of those. <laughs> I've already, yeah, I've already had my fair share this year in eating contests. Yeah, so. Yeah, beautiful. I didn't realize there were so many fields back here. Yeah, cause the parkway is just over there. I can actually see Home Depot just over there. Yeah. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Just perfect. Not over hot. Um, it's gonna be a beautiful evening. Uh, the only thing is there's, there's bugs out here. Let's get the bugs. Another little bridge crossing. There's the back side of the Hooskow right there. I don't see a zipper, Don. No zipper. <laughs> no zipper. They do have a Ferris wheel. They have that crazy yo-yo over there. And a fun slide. Well, everybody's having a good time playing some some laser tag. <laughs> so the fair pricing is six dollars for adults and kids ten and under are free. And fall is here in the Smokies. This is the first fall decor I've seen. Scarecrows are out in forest and fall is here in the Smokies, there's Emery's 5 and 10, a little little tribute to 
Emery's. Of course, you can find Emery's at the island in Pigeon Forge. But they have a long history here in the Smokies. Yeah. Fresh pop kettle corn. Ooh, smells good. What is this? What is that? It's a it's a talking bush. I I think I've seen everything. A talking bush. It is. Uh, you gonna get a picture of the talking bush? All right. Uh, <laughs> All right check out this uh, semi here. It's kind of like a. Yeah, it's uh it's like a hot rod semi. Yeah, definitely chromed out. They have turkey legs and corn and loaded baked potatoes and have all kinds of vendors and I think there's a great big huge cow over there. I forgot her name again. I know everybody always reminds me her name, but what's her name? Mary Bell? Maribel? I don't know. Yeah, of course they have the these guys over here they try to sell you a knife or something. <laughs> It's never a fair unless someone tries to sell you a knife, right? <laughs> and over here you have chicken, you have lemonade, corn dogs, and chicken baskets and fries. And it's definitely not a fair here in East Tennessee unless you have Maribel, I guess, right? Now put in the comments below, I know you guys will correct me again. She is one big jersey, right? I think that's what she has. She's a chocolate milk one, right? The chocolate milk. So the first thing I think we're gonna do is check out all the animals. We're gonna check out everything farm because I love this. It brings back so many memories of growing up on a farm. There's a little little paddle wheel over there. And we're gonna check out the 4-H and everything else. They definitely do things different here in the mountains. This one runs on moonshine, Dawn. That's awesome. White lightning. Awesome. Yeah, I know there's, there's different ways to shuck an ear of corn and I guess that's one of them there and I guess if you get thirsty you got that option also right and I love looking at all these old tractors farm all John Deere you know, let's head into the barn and check out the cattle yet again I love all the fall theming and we're here at the livestock show Well, hello, guys and gals. I guess these are girls, right? These are the girls. Well, these guys here are, are tired after a long day here of showing. Oh, yeah, very beautiful. Is that a limousine? I don't, I don't know. Could be. Could be. Uh, that guy there looks like he's getting all prettied up. And over here, he's just anxious to... I think he wants to he wants to go for a little walk. <laughs> I have a little butterfly enclosure here. We're going to head on in and check it out. Butterflies have not four, but six legs. I didn't know that. Oh, there is butterflies in there. Yeah, the butterflies are, are up there. Oh, they're, they're beautiful. Yeah, look at beautiful butterflies. I bet you during the daytime they're very active, but it's almost bedtime for these guys. And um, there's another, see, here, here's a fake one, but that one over there, that's a real one. <laughs> so. Yeah. Yeah, they're, they're up there. The butterflies are. The butterfly over there. Then there's a little butterfly he's hanging out. Yeah, just over there. He's a, he's a really nice color there. Yeah. We're going to let the butterflies be. Cute little butterfly exhibit. They were sleeping, though. They're monarchs. They're really beautiful. We've come to the best part. Dawn's friends. Chickens. You ready to go to check out the chickens? There ain't nothing but us chickens. Oh, the wow, there they are. Cock-a-doodle-doo. How are you? Good morning, or in this case, good evening. You know, they're pretty rambunctious for it being late in the day. 
Hello. Gobble gobble. Or that, that's a that's a turkey though, right? Yeah, it's old foghorn leghorn. <laughs> Look at these little guys or gals. These are the ones they serve, I think, at the Dolly Parton Stampede. Oh no. Yeah, that's that's the ones there. <laughs> wow, you got something to crow about. But you did win a really big ribbon here. It says the reserve champion. Yeah. Making all that racket over here. You gonna crow for me? Cockadoodoo? How are you? As soon as I walk away, I know you're gonna crow. That's how it works. Okay. You <laughs> yeah. Well, nice ribbon. And there are chickens everywhere. Hello. <laughs> oh, wow. One of you guys uh, just hatched. Just a little baby, huh? Yeah. It just hatched. So we're in this barn and all of a sudden there's like this really nice furniture. They call us the, the Ferris of the Fair. Huh. Ferris of the Fair. So a lot of folks don't know this, but Sevier County, you know, Pigeon Forge, Gatlinburg is home to farm. In fact, it's like one of the bigger industries behind tourism. And there's still a lot of farms in the area. There's a little bit of history of the farmers in these mountains. So this is the largest produce. Look at the size of those carrots, Don. <laughs> that's like, that's a pretty big carrot. And I got a big old tomato. And here's some photos from past fairs. A little bit of a ring there. Uh, so they've been holding it here. Look at this photo here. This is the parkway out there. This is like where Kroger would be and Publix. It's it's all empty field. Well, that's a long time ago. All these little miniature farms, different farm equipment. Oh wow, there's a there's a feeding operation going on there. Yeah, covered silage feed and bunk. And then there's a silo. It's sticking right out of the top of the glass enclosure. <laughs> I love old silos and barns. Here's another little feeding operation here. And you can see the, the silage bin there. And fall is definitely in the air. Once again, up here on, this, on the upper level here. And you can see all the different aprons that folks have made. Little knitted hats. Yeah, it's everybody's uh, arts, art project. And they have toys of the past. Ooh. Oh, look at that Snoopy. That Snoopy, it's way before my time. I do remember that little clock down there, though. And a miniature version of that dog. So I guess there's some of these hand-me-down toys I do remember. Oh, I do remember the school bus, though. And that airplane. You remember the school bus and airplane? Yeah. And that little. I had the school bus, airplane, and the register. And the register? And the, that really cool thing. Yeah. And then you got this guy here. You can still buy him new. The toy people had a bouncing buggy. You no, know, a bouncing buggy? The clowns got a jalopy. <laughs> they, look, they look happy, don't they? Mm -hmm. The bouncing buggy? He's got a jalopy. A jalopy? Mm -hmm. I wonder if that's where the term jalopy came from. Probably. From here. <laughs> yeah. They have a whole section dedicated to quilts. And this here is the horticulture or the, the floral area. Almost every fair has an area dedicated to fairy gardens. 
And this is what we have here. Here's a little Halloween fairy <laughs> garden. Is, oh, there is a spider over there. And this one here has got a, a toadstool made out of uh, root beer caps. <laughs> it does, it does. Very creative. Looks like that dragon there has been drinking Pepsi. <laughs> yeah, that, this one over here is nesting. How wonderful. Yeah, crazy. There's a crazy moose in a, in a wagon. Here's a little camping trip inspired one. Yeah, I wouldn't want to be in that, that tent. Oh, wow. I love this quilt right here with the little like Amish girls on there. And this one here's got some drafts. This one's excellent in machine quilting. Yeah, I would agree with that. It's, it's a very lovely uh, quilt. Oh, this one here I think is my favorite. It's got the the, the house and the barn and it's kind of like a snowy you know you can see the snow coming off the the roof there kind of reminds me of a, a snowy smoky mountain morning oh, there's a lot of things to take in oh, there's a little painting of of Betty Betty boop 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 she boop right that's what she used to say a very creative artist. Oh, that one there is nice too with the cow. That's cute. Yeah. And there's one up there with the bear. Took third place. A lot of creative folks. I like the birdhouse. You like the, oh, you like that, that birdhouse? Yeah, and the bird birds. Oh, that is really cool. Wow, it's definitely. I'm not sure what's going on with this. Well, that, that's for a squirrel oh, back there. It? Yeah, huh? A lot of great paintings. Everybody is. Oh, there's a lady slipper up there. That's pretty. Yeah. We've seen real ones in the wild. I took first place. It did. Oh, there's an old tobacco barn or a, a cantilever barn. Yeah, Sevier County's home to a lot of these barns. Yeah. You can find a lot of them here in the Smoky Mountains. There's even one in Cades Cove. This must have been a fun one to put together. You got to eat all the cookies before you, you made it. Of course, this here is from the Girl Scouts. Yeah, they did, a, they did a good job. This one here is real creative. It's got like the puffy cotton sky and of course the silhouette of a bear going up the mountain. Is that one of those worms from Beetlejuice? It is. It is, but it's it, but it's a gourd. <laughs> this is a very nice little fair. It's not real big, but if you were gonna go to a fair, this is the one I would go to. Everything in this booth is made here in Tennessee. Of course, Mayfield Dairy is in Tennessee. We visited the factory, and this here is Cades Cove Good Fixins Buffalo Style Chicken. I never even heard of that. Of course, Wamplers, Sausage Patties, uh, Frosty Morn, uh, Martha White, made here in Tennessee. Of course, Tennessee Pride. I would hope that was made <laughs> in Tennessee. And Swaggery's is right here in Sevier County. That's the hometown sausage company. And of course, Jack Daniels is made here. A couple different wine distilleries and moonshine don't forget we make moonshine in tennessee we make a lot of moonshine too we make a lot and um little debbie's a lot of folks don't know that but little debbie's is made down near chattanooga moon pies near chattanooga yeah goo goo clusters i believe they're over near nashville could be wrong but and of course the old mill here in pigeon forge is always milling up some some good products and last but not least bush's best baked beans and you can visit their factory and have a nice little restaurant there highly suggest it somebody told me a long time ago these are supposed to keep spiders away what are these they're i don't know it doesn't say what they are there's the butterfly enclosure there but i absolutely love all these old barns there's so much charm here it's not modern it's it's just just perfect 
think I found the grandstands, or at least the back side of it. Yeah, I got some bathrooms over that ways. And I hear they have one heck of a rodeo here. Yeah, it's not tonight. I believe it's still coming up, but it's it's big time. They have bounce houses for kids, all kinds of little things for the kids to do. I got some arts and crafts over here, and they have a looks like a something eating contest going on over there. Well, I never turned down a good old eating contest, so it was an ice cream eating contest. Oh, and there's ice cream everywhere. I should have entered the ice cream eating contest. I just got done doing a cheeseburger. That ice cream was getting real soupy towards the end. It looked like fun and it's ice cream everywhere. Uh, maybe next year. They're gonna have a little magic show later on. Look at all these funnel cakes. Oh wow, they got fruity bubbles. That's my favorite. So we're gonna get this Oreo one. Look at that. Ah, it looks good, doesn't it? <laughs> This is where we got our funnel cake. Oh, wow, look at that. Yes. I like that second verse that the first time we were living today. War and strife on every hand, and violence fills our land. First to rest. And the sun is just setting just over there. How beautiful. I love a fair in the evening with all the lights. Normally this is a quiet field, but for one week out of the year it turns into a lot of people's memories a lot of people's dreams it becomes a place of of wonder and excitement and a guy just looking for his keys yeah, main street market what about cotton candy well, that's absolutely beautiful she does a lot of our pageants as well so she's had a really eventful year she's got to do a lot of community service and parades and all kinds right of Right next to stuff. the Little Pigeon River here. The best parts of being a fair queen. We keep them busy all year with fun activities. She's done a lot over the past year. She actually competed in the Ultimate International Miss Pageant as well. Um, so she'll tell you a little bit about that. Beautiful sunset. There's some folks down there swimming. Tiffany actually had a flag. Yeah, there's some folks down there swimming <laughs> in the Little Pigeon River. bears you collected they have a pageant going on over here. Yeah, all these little Cinderella's and that running around. Pretty busy here. Yeah, so it's the fairest of the fair pageant. This is called. And you can see all kinds of little girls getting ready to, to go up and put on a good show. You're not the Mayfield cow. I mean, the real one in real life. Are you there? Oh, you got beautiful eyes, you do. You do. Yeah, oh wow, that, she's getting <laughs> some itchies and scratchies over there, huh? Oh. Little chickens. <laughs> so chicks are five dollars each. It must be sold in lots of two or more. Don, can we get a, can we get a chicken? Maybe we can get a couple, can we get a couple of goats? Oh, there's a whole area filled full of bunnies. Oh, there's a Stevie right there, Don. Oh, yes. Yeah, looks like Stevie. It's Stevie's little cousin, Fred. <laughs> yeah, you can take your own rabbit home for $10. Just $10, Don, we can have a bunny. Yeah, the ducks are ten dollars. Yeah. <laughs> and then there's a there's a pig. Well hell wow, well, they're super friendly come right over to ya. How about how about a, a miniature pony? 
Yeah. Can you eat the hill? Hello, goats. Yeah, they're they're big. You guys are big. I bet you they cause a lot of trouble. I bet you they love the hill. <laughs> this is called Red Box Burgers. We've had their burgers before. They're really, really good. They got taco trucks. They have an iced tea stand over there. Free laser tag. Everything you can imagine. I like that stand there. Totally fried. They're not hiding it. They're just saying everything here is fried. Oh, Dipsy Dog Mix. Hot dogs on a stick. Oh, yeah. And these little little buckets of fries. It is. It is. And we are here at the carnival. The we have bumper cars just over there, and you can win yourself a taco or or maybe a wiener dog. Uh, they got some sausages. They got some turkey legs. Some corn over there. Smells really good. I love the signs here. You got. Put some south in your mouth. Over here it's called Guilty Pleasures. And over there it says, bite me. <laughs> They're very creative, aren't they? Count the memories and not the calories. I love chocolate and keep calm and eat cotton candy. Uh, they have a merry-go-round and no no fighting <laughs> wow you gotta love the sounds and the smell there's some huge dragons you can of course they have the ring of fire yeah I would definitely get sick on that I don't know what's worse, this here or or that crazy zipper. The zipper. The zipper. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm not gonna ride any rides. I'm still feeling the zipper about a week or so ago. So this is called the Wacky Shack. Oh, you can punch some bags up there. Definitely wacky, isn't it? What is this thing over here? This looks like something I used to work with in the plastic industry. Kind of like a huge robot of some sort. Oh, oh wow, that would definitely make me sick. Upside down? Upside down? Oh, wow. You know, half of them people look like they're going to puke. Ring of fire. cool fair they got a lot of really like one-of-a-kind rides I haven't seen everywhere and look at that beautiful sunset in the background a huge skateboard jalopy junction oh, there's a huge giant sloth a purple panda or a purple trash panda at that. And old. Yeah, old Oscar the Grouch. Scram. <laughs> yeah, you can get a. Uh, I think it's a Rick pickle. <laughs> Uh, a Rick Pickle. Yeah, even a mechanical bowl there. 
you live by the horns, you, you get the horns, is that how it goes, or? Grab the bull by the horns. <laughs> yeah. And that's it for that. Dawn's gonna get some iced tea for two dollars. Watermelon iced tea, it looks good. Yeah. So what did you think about the Sevier County Fair? It was a fun day at the Sevier County Fair. We had a lot of fun. We did, we did. And it's our first time ever doing this. We've never been here before. I love it. I, I love it, was, it too. It was a cute little fair. It is. And um, I, I don't know the reason why we've never done it before. I think it's because we have Dollywood here and I don't know, it just didn't seem but. All these other attractions and go-karts. And... Yeah, so. But you know what? It was well worth it. I had a great time. Uh, we had a funnel cake earlier mm -hmm. and we had some iced tea. Got some tea. Yeah, some tea to take <laughs> home. They give you like a free refill or something. So yeah. pretty, pretty good deal. It was like six bucks or something. But anyways, uh, we didn't ride any rides because we just got done riding rides. <laughs> yeah, you, you can see another video. It was the zipper. The Ugh, zipper. zipper. <laughs> yeah. The I'm, zipper. I'm not going to ride. But anyways, but the rides here are really cool. I love the setting. It was just a great evening. The animals were awesome. Um, wow, six bucks to get in. You can't beat that these days. Six dollars per person to get in. Kids 10 and under were free. It was awesome. So I guess, Dawn, would you do this again? Yeah. yeah I would definitely do it again. forward to it next year. I'm thinking about maybe coming back maybe towards uh, the end of the week, maybe, and yeah. come back through and you know, catch on the weekend when it's really crazy. But, folks, that's going to do it for today. Here in Sevier County, here in Sevierville. If you guys like this vlog, give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe if you haven't so you don't miss these upcoming Smoky Mount Adventures. And until next time. Thanks for watching. Bye, everyone. Bye.